hello guys in this video i will be taking down my two months cornrows and i will also be sharing a secret with you guys what i am addicted to doing to my own hair i just want you to grab a cup of tea as i am even making this voice over i am sipping tea guys i just want you to also grab a cup of tea because i know you will definitely learn from this video and then before i start i will first of all oil my scalp with my oil with freedom styles magic hair growth oil and if i am keeping my cornrows i usually co-wash my hair with the cornrows on i will co-wash it with shampoo first of all apply shampoo and then before i will use conditioner and i know you guys will be like ah oh, freedom nasty i usually co-wash my hair twice every month and even if you think it's nasty it's your own belief for me it works fine i did it to cutting my own hair i will just sit down grab a scissors i will just be cutting my hair because i hate the shrinkage of my hair even if i applied a lot of nice products leave conditioner seeing the shrinkage seeing shrinkage Guys, I will just be annoyed of my own hair. I will just grab a scissors and I will start to cut my hair. I know my hair would have been longer than this. My hair grows very nicely, but I don't allow my hair to be in rest. I don't allow my hair to grow. And even if I'm not grabbing a scissors, I will just like use my, my fingers. I will start cutting my hair, just like uh, crunching it off breaking my hair i don't know why i am addicted to doing it and then uh, i am trying to avoid uh, cutting my hair or breaking my hair that is why i am keeping my cornrows long i think you can see you can see the length of my hair my hair would have been longer than this because of the what i am doing to my hair because of the way i'm breaking my hair cutting my hair that is why i don't have a uh, waist length yet sometimes my mind will just be telling me to relax my hair i know i will not fall to that victim i would love to keep my natural hair but i also pray that god will help me so that we like free myself from just cutting my hair or using my fingers to break my hair and i know it is not nice the products i am using the leave conditioner i'm using on my hair they are working very nice, but I don't allow my hair to rest. I hate the shrinkage. I don't know if you guys will understand it. I hate it a lot. That is why I usually cut my hair. And even in this video, like I even promised myself, I said, I will not cut my hair this time. I also ended up cutting my hair. Even my fiance knows that I usually cut my hair and he will just slap my my hands off we say stop cutting your hair and i am trying to stop cutting my hair and i really hope that god will help me and i will stop cutting my hair my hair is growing very nicely and it is um, very very thin and uh, dark with the oil i am using and then uh, this is the reason why i don't usually keep my hair unbraided i usually braid my hair to just avoid cutting my hair you can see now after taking down the old corn rolls, I also ended up braiding it all back and I will just be co-washing my hair with the corn rolls. And uh, I just want you guys to pray for me to stop cutting my own hair and uh, what I am addicted to, I know is not good, but I'm trying to stop it. I want my hair to grow longer than this. I will just braid it all back and uh, apply oil. And uh, I'm still trying to stop, but look at this. I still ended up cutting my hair. And uh, this is not the shedding I got. Oh, this is what I cut off from my hair. And uh, cutting my hair every day is no good. I'm not giving my hair chance to grow more. And I pray that God will help me so that I will stop cutting my hair. Because I know it's addiction. But I just want God to help me. And I hope you learned from this video. And if you are also addicted to doing the same weird thing, I just want you to comment in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video. And bye. <music>